If Tanks now is unto the most I ja, Rastafari, is I Emmanuel, the Naya Bingi vegan once again, bringing you an African dish today from Ghana. And that is some, well, my variation on jollof rice um, made with fried plantain and a celery salad. So I'm going to take you over to the ingredients as per usual and then go through the method and show you it on a dish at the end. Okay, so we've got a plant in there, got some celery there for the salad, some tomato puree, some mixed herbs, a couple of onions, garlic, curry powder in that jar, three large vine tomatoes, some ginger, some thyme, three vegetarian stock cubes, and one ingredient which I've forgotten are the green chilies, but I'll be getting those out. And the rice itself, of course, brown rice. Ja, that's the fire. Okay, so we've got some brown rice in that tub, and in this bowl there's some sweet corn underneath that, there's some peas, and right there we've got a few green chilies. So I've got some palm oil in this frying pan to start frying the onions and garlic and chilies. So the celery salad's done, which is just vegetable oil, black pepper, garlic and cut celery. The rice, I'm doing three portions, so it's three cups of rice in there which are boiling and as I said I've got some palm oil in there ready to fry the onions and garlic and the planting eventually too. I'm boiling the brown rice in this pot here for 15 to 20 minutes and I'm going to be frying, I've got some garlic in there, some chilies, some green chilies I'm going to be adding onion to that. Um, I've got some vegetable stock cubes in there for some stock there's the planting ready for frying and there is the three vine tomatoes that I've pressed um, and I'm going to be frying those with the onions and garlic and stuff. Yeah. So to the pressed tomatoes I've cut up a couple of bay leaves that are in there and I'm going to add a teaspoonful of thyme to the mixture and also a tablespoonful of curry powder I'm also adding a level teaspoonful of mixed herbs and a good part of a tube of tomato puree which I'll show you once I've pulled it out. Just going to add a level teaspoonful of ginger to that as well. And what we've got going on over here, got some planting fry in there. The rice is on and it's going to be parboiled now, so I'm going to turn that off. And in here I've got garlic and chilies, which is going to be joined by some onions shortly. And here I've got some stock made up from two vegetable stock cubes. So I added a stock cube to the tomato mix. The onions, garlic and chilies are frying away there. There's the brown rice, which I'm going to add the sweet corn and peas to. And there's the planting, which is still cooking away on a slow cook. I'm going to ask, add some sliced carrots into the onions, just to give the dish more colour. So I've added some carrots to the onions, garlic and chilies. I've added the sweet corn and peas to the rice which will require further cooking, but with the sauce once that's added. And the planting are just doing their own thing. So I've added the tomato mixed to the onions, garlic, chilies, carrots. And I'm going to stir that in. And then I'm going to add stock to the rice and add everything into the paste once it's finished. The rice being extremely nice. The cost of this one, um, it's going to feed three people amply, maybe four. I'd say 
with the plantains, tomatoes, maybe fiber, which is good value, as always, economical vegan food, tasty food, food for life, life for food, yeah, Rastafari. I've just added a little bit of chili powder to the tomato mix, because um, it's not hot enough for me. Obviously, if you're making this for children, you can leave out the chilies, you can leave out the chili powder and just have it as a more tomato based meal, which will be tasty same way with the ingredients given. But if you like me, it likes everything hot, nothing bland, then chili, chili powder is all good in the hood. So I'm gonna add this jug of vegetable stock to the tomato mix, bring it to the boil, cook it for a little while before I add it to the rice and then the food will be ready along with the plant in here. So the tomato is chili sauce is boiling so I'm going to add that to the rice and then cook the rice further until the rice is cooked. Add in any water if needed, clean water, boiled water and then um, I will show you it once it's mixed in and then on a plate. Okay, so there's the gel of rice. Just has to boil down and cook the rice properly, which will probably take another 10 to 15 minutes, having been part boiled before. The planting is ready, salad's ready, so next time you'll be seeing it on a plate. So, there you go, vegan gel of rice. Three good servings, celery salad. Such a presides over Ryman table. Ciao, Rastafari.